Hey guys, it's Gary. I know I'm usually not one to do reviews or unboxing videos, but I was really excited about this one and I ripped the package open as soon as I got it. Um, these are Y trucks, third generation trucks. These are the blue ones with red bushings. And I have here the reds with white bushings. Um, the craftsmanship is great, like paints evenly coated, really great. The, even the Y trucks logos on the bottom. Um, from what I can tell, these are just perfect, but I haven't tried them yet. And I'm going to set them up on my Homewood 2010 guitar deck that Justin drew for me. Um, and this is such a great deck, you can hear the pop. Just how, uh, just how solid it is, maple ply. Um, and I'm going to throw some flat face G7 wheels on there. So, I'll get back to you. Okay, my first impression of these trucks... The mounting system is really cool. Um, he provides two tools for you. One is the, the 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 thicker hexagon shape is for the kingpin, and the thinner shape is for the mounting screws on top. Now, I actually prefer these hexagonal shapes because they're much easier to mount. Because when I use the the regular, I don't know, I don't know. I guess this would be Phillips head screws they strip out for me and when I use this tool it really grips on deep in the screw and you don't, you're not really going to strip out the screw which is nice and even if you do strip out the screw there's two extra mounting screws which is nice um, here's the trucks on the board without any wheels and there's no grip on it yet um, the trucks by default from the factory come fairly loose and I'm assuming this is because they don't want to tighten the bushings and squeeze them and have them like that when they send them out to you but just from going like this I could tell that the turning system is very smooth and I can't wait to put some wheels on okay guys I have the board entirely set up now with my old sheet of foamy greatness and flat face g7 wheels um, one thing I noticed was as soon as I put the wheel on the axle the axle kind of hugs the wheel very tightly it's really nice you can hear how fast the wheel is spinning on this axle it's amazing it's almost like a real skateboard um, and the auto block nuts, as I started tightening, it went from loose to tighter, and you can feel the little plastic, I don't know what it is actually, the, the coating on the inside, hugging the axle, so I trust that these wheels aren't going to fall out when I'm using the trucks, which is really nice, because that's a big problem I have with Tech Deck trucks. Um, these are, I have them loose right now, the trucks, and the turning system is just phenomenal it's great um, and the way they grind is perfect because for me one of the big issues is the kingpin sticks out on Y trucks you don't have that issue because it's a round screw not an actual kingpin it screws into the base plate so when you're grinding especially on Smith and Feeble grinds there's nothing to interrupt your grind or to have you hang up which is really nice um, overall I would highly recommend Y trucks. These are perfect. Um, the grind is just the most important thing, and it it's just I can't spot anything wrong with the way they grind. the The paint is even. the They look beautiful. The craftsmanship is great. The turning system is great. Um, you can have these as loose as you want, and the you know there's no nut here, so it's not gonna actually fall out. All the mounting hardware is extremely high quality and the way the the wheels roll on the trucks it's just I've never had a pair of trucks where the we wheels rolled like this it's great um Christoph is also a great guy he sent me a whole bunch of Y truck stickers so I think I'm set for life on these Y truck stickers that's for sure um definitely go to ytrucks.com and check them out